Hello and welcome, my name is Kyle. Thanks for joining me for another episode of Let's Play Darkest Dungeon. Um, so I know I said I was going to go fight a boss in this next video, um, but I realized that I don't quite have a healer ready to do that. Um, so what it is, I, I'm going to probably use Daphne to do that uh, next uh, mission where we try to kill the Brigand 8 Pounder. So I went ahead and just dumped her in a stress relief. I know she doesn't have a lot of stress, um, but I didn't want to take her out and then deal with her and whatever so she's just gonna be completely stress-free um, for the boss run and what I'm doing instead um, is taking out this party and this is a weird kind of a party um, I'm hoping that he is gonna be our main healer with weird reconstruction um, by the way weird is a old like uh, English word for fate so it's kind of cool that he's basically reconstructing what happened it's kind of neat um, but anyway, that's going to be our main healer. Now it does put bleeds on people, so we're gonna we're gonna pack a few extra bandages uh, just to deal with that. Um, otherwise, you know, I'm gonna take this new uh, new jester I picked up, and I did get rid of solo and put slice off in instead. Um, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna take out a couple of people from our last mission. So Bushir is gonna come out again. Um, and uh, Vibers is going to come out too. Now these people do all have a little bit of stress, you can notice. So what I'm going to try to do is manage that as much as possible. Uh, I mean, even he has, you know, four blocks there. So they, they're all a little bit stressed out with the exception of the Jester. So I'm going to try to counteract that by camping fairly early on in the mission. Not super early, but, uh, you know, as soon as it looks like any one of them is in the danger of uh, freaking out, I will camp. Um, so this is a Warren's mission, so we are going to have to bring extra uh, venom, anti-venom as well, and extra bandages to kind of deal with the bleed. So just need to be aware of that as we make our provisions. I'm going to take four of those, four of those for now. I'm going to take two keys. Let's just get our torches and everything else squared away. We could just take eight torches. Could end up in a dark, dark run by the time it's over. Let's see, I kind of want one more of these and one more of these. Let's take two more torches then. That leaves me with 5,000 and when it's all said and done. And I'll just ignore things with holy water and medicine if I can. I don't think anyone's curious, so yeah, we'll just have to ignore those things and see what we can make happen. Because remember, we're farming money, uh, we're farming experience because we need to release the st relieve the stress of our uh, level three party members and also level their abilities up to three. Um, so I did send two of those in, actually, uh, to get stress relief this week, which will be good. And this mission gives us portraits, which we need to unlock the uh, level three uh, skill set in the guild. So this should be good for us overall. Even the fiercest beast will lay down when it is not eaten. Steal their food. All right, so we just have to gather three grain sacks. I think the obvious approach here is just to go here and then up and then oh, it doesn't connect there. That's kind of annoying. Let's see. So I, we go to here to check and then maybe here and then back through. Yeah, I think I'll do that. So yeah, this is kind of an interesting mix of, of uh, heroes here got an extra torch which is good we kind of started really low so I don't know how you know they it's not a named group it didn't you know you know there's that new feature where uh, hero types get named um, hmm, that sucks as we might need to go look at that uh, there's a trap ahead so guess what it's time for trap debuff skill check 20 across the board all right Perfect.
You need holy water to deal with that, so we are going to ignore. And you had 20, right? You're the, or no, who had, was it? Yeah, let's have you deal with that. This is going to go badly. <laughs> Obviously. Uh, at least he didn't get the bleed, though, so we'll, we'll be happy with that. Obviously, it was resisted. There's a little delay there on the notification, but that's okay. All right. And we do have to go down here and check out this room. All right, so I think this is the... Maybe it's not. It bears the faded sigil of our family. Oh, okay, so it was a green sack. Okay. Another torch. Really good. Ouch. Ambushed by foul invention. Resisted the bleed again. Let's go ahead and pump that to two. Here's another one, right off the bat. This is really good. I'm gonna go ahead and camp, I think. Just focus on buffs. I wish you could see, can I see their camping skills real quick? So I don't need, like stress resist is good. I'm definitely gonna be doing that. Don't really need heals at this point. So stress relief and stress resist will be good. Turn back time, like the share song, right? Uh, so we, we can actually, yeah, and he gets a buff there. So lots of stress resist, but not stress relief. So maybe, I won't be camping here. Sorry, I'm just looking through this one more time. So he can just do that. He can reduce one character stress by 30. He can reduce everyone by 20 and by mocking someone. So, but he can't mock himself, obviously, which is weird. A jester should be able to do that. Hmm. I mean, he is getting pretty high, but I'm going to wait. That could be my downfall. But since we don't have really a way of relieving stress, we just can make ourselves more resistant to it. We're going to be focusing on like crits and stuff, basically. So what I think I want to do is actually go back here and go up. And then... Hmm. Because there's an object there, basically is why. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I mean, it could be the grain sack. That'd be weird if it was that early. I don't know that I would stop the mission. Nope, just a torch. Which is fine. Not a lot of gold so far. Hungry? It's fine. Alright. We know it's in this room. Um. It's. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get the scouting chance. Okay. Traps like crazy, which means stress because no one can really deal with it. He's got to do it. All right, I'm camping here. I got. I'm just gonna do it. A moment of respite, a chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. So they lose stress. Yeah, I got to do that. Unfortunately, even though no one really needs to heal. All right. So let's focus on stress relief first. Yeah, you do that to him. That's actually really good. I'm going to buff him. I'm going to buff everybody. Let's give him a pep talk. We have one left, so he can 
Reduce his own stress by 25 and increase everyone else's stress by 5. So five is basically like a block, I think. Well, that's weird, who knows. What else, do we have anything else? He can reduce his own stress by 25, and increase everyone's by five. So the same thing. He's got more, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take that. As the light and no attack. Purchase, Good. Spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. So we got some buffs, which was really nice. Um, we're gonna go this way and do this loop, and then come back. I think is the plan. Uh, yeah. Did I bring shovels? Such I thought for a second there I forgot surprising. to bring shovels for These some reason. predate even the earliest settlers. Hmm. Could be one right there. I'm gonna go north. Pile of scrolls. If we burn these, does something horrible happen? I don't remember, so we're going to try it. Oh. He had a quirk removed. Okay. Very cool. I meant to uh, buff the light before that combat came along because I didn't want to get surprised, which we did. Or did not, so that's good, but... Alright, good resistance is there. I don't know, did we get surprised? It seems like we're getting attacked like crazy. Okay. Is this the first combat we've had in this whole thing? I don't. I feel like we haven't done anything yet. Alright, what do we got here? He can pull, that doesn't matter because they're all the same. Vulnerability Hex, I haven't used him a lot yet, so you gotta forgive me. He's gonna mark them. For dodge, do they have a lot of dodge? They have no dodge. Uh, let's do Weakening Curse then. They resisted it, but that's fine. I mean, I think Hugh is really good here. As the enemy crumbles. Yeah, Dirk said. Oh, that moves him, doesn't it? Yeah, I forgot about that. That's fine. I think. Can you just yell? Can you just hit this guy? Perfect. Oh, and that moves him. That's really good. One thing I keep meaning to look at is can you rearrange these? Because I hate when they come with different skills. Like if you're used to using, like, say, a man at arms, right? And bellows on four for the one you're using but then you get one where it's on three for some weird reason just because the way the skills are laid out it's just kind of it's just weird uh no i don't need to move you so i need to look into like can it be can they be changed basically uh what's here do we know it's an empty room all right yeah i don't care then combat here for sure so we're gonna want to be uh, we're out of food that sucks they had to have changed the eating mechanic people are eating a lot more food it seems to me and we are making nothing like this mission has there's no no treasure to be found no combat really All right, this is a pretty, like, because this has, like, one of, like, everything, there's so much bad stuff that could happen in this fight. So what we're going to do. I want to pull that vomiting pig to the front. I want to just get rid of it. Perfect. the fiend falls. Faint hope blossoms. I want to stun that guy if I can. Um, let's 
Stun the chopper. A devastating blow. That's such a great attack. It's crit usually. And now he's stunned. Okay. I'm going to battle ballot here. Just boost us all up. I'm thinking of bellowing. Then I hew. Press this advantage. Give them yep. no quarter. We dodge whatever that was. Okay. Cool. I didn't. I thought we were just gonna put a bleed on that guy. This is going really well. Um, I don't want a Dirk. Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. We can move him. This expedition at least promises success. Okay. That went about that fight there went about as good as that fight can go. That was really, really good. Didn't take a lot of stress, didn't take a lot of damage. I don't think we know it's in here, so let's light up. In radiance, may we find victory. And yeah, there's nothing here. Okay. So now we have to do a lot of backtracking. We're just going to go, hopefully, you know, just across the top. Hopefully it's not right there. That would be so bad. We'll take so much stress. I mean, I think what I'll actually do is go here, then down, and then back around if I need to. Alright, and we know there's definitely going to be combat in that room as well, so... Just make sure we get the torches lit before we go in. This hunger Axel situation is really bad. I think they made a... I think they made the missions, the medium missions require more food and the same for long. Like I had that same problem when I went on that first long mission. It was like the match is struck. crazy how much food people are eating. So here's our item. And there was no combat in here either. Okay. Well, again. Empty room, treasure combat though right there I'm gonna go here and see what this item is and then I'm getting out of here uh, let's keep going there's a trap who was it it was you right with 20 I mean, there's pretty much no chance of him getting it. That, but yeah, I mean, I took the stress for that, which is probably bad. But I just want to. There's a chest I can get here without combat, so I want to. I want to see what it is. Basically, it's a torch. Brilliant. All right. Well, uh, we didn't make very much cold at all on that mission, and we took a lot of stress for these guys. Um, so that was kind of that's kind of a disappointment. Um, yeah, that's kind of weird. Our supplies are replenished. The soldiers will feast tonight. Maybe because like oh, we didn't even get any portraits. Which that place is uh, we get three for their quest, but get a common. Yeah, that wasn't very good. That was pretty bad overall. Now uh, we did get Vivers level two. He's obsessed with cleanliness, stress heal. Light resist night owl, so he could be a good night person. That's bad, I gotta get rid of that. And steady, okay. I was lord of this place before the crows and rats made it their domain. 
All right, so Cornelius and Rames have had their stress taken care of. Unfortunately, Rames also lost 500 gold after becoming tipsy and buying around for the house. Uh, and Daphne recovered stress. So we had three people in stress relief on that run. Uh, which is really good. We don't really... Our roster's full. I don't think there's anyone I want to get rid of. Um, what I do want to do before I forget is get rid of this uh, torn rotator cuff on this guy. Because that's just... I mean, he's a melee character. He needs that. And sometimes I forget about doing that. Um, that's so much stress still. Who would I even take out to take on the 8-pounder at this point? Two Hellions, a healer. And an Arbalist. Could take him out again. Was that who I just took? Yeah, he was pretty good. I mean, he's got a lot of stress, but we can deal with that, actually. Two healers, two Hellions? Or, you know, he's not necessarily a healer, but that could be pretty cool. Oh, excuse me, that could be pretty cool. I may try that. All right, but that is going to do it for this video. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I will see you next time.